Hey guys, it's Fuzzy again. This is an old video, and today I'm gonna be showing you how you can fix Adobe Captivate. Well, if you are up into the e-learning section, then Adobe Captivate you must have come across. While talking about Adobe Captivate, I'm gonna check out here so that you can make me see it up. Well, uh, what problem is I'm gonna tell you about? When you open Adobe Captivate out there, and the thing that we face, I'm gonna having I'm having 64-bit 2017 version. Uh, the problem that I'm facing, and you might also be facing, that's why you're clicking on the video. Well, that it gets stuck on the starting screen. On the green screen loading, it gets stuck and says loading. Loading and forever goes on loading. <laughs> well, I really hate that too. So let's make it for just a bit, just wait, just a bit for it to start. Okay, so coming across, you're gonna be seeing that it's getting stuck uh, every uh, time like this and it isn't going across that. So, well, it isn't responding either. It's not showing any process. If we go to task manager, showing up, but it's not working. So it's not getting across this. Well, there's a problem. We're gonna solve it. I'm gonna close it out from here. And what you need to do is to go on to your PC. Uh, means this for your PC, and simply go into Windows, and from here select Fonts. And the problem that the captured is facing that at the time of loading Fonts, it really messes up with that, and it isn't working as it should. So probably that's the problem of fonts. So how you can solve it? I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna copy the fonts folder. I'm gonna paste it out here, just to make a backup so that everything doesn't goes off at the time if I delete these fonts or else. So just as a form of backup, uh, so that it doesn't work at all. Okay. So once it has been copied, for example, mine has been copied. So all you need to do is to go back, double click on the fonts folder, open it up. Select one, press enter plus A and press shift plus delete. You might be thinking that what I'm doing, but remember you might not be able to delete all the fonts so that we also already have backups. So I'm going to delete all these fonts because we're going to see SQL and see details because these fonts cannot be deleted and we can click on the skip, always skip. So that that's going to skip the fonts that you cannot delete. Are you sure you want to delete this collection as font collection deleting the all fonts? I'm going to just simply click on yes. And I'm gonna be just simply yes, I want to do the entire phone set. So first of all, we are just having a look that it does work out or not. So once you do so, that's gonna be remembering some few fonts that you already have. I'm gonna refresh it, and I'm going to click on the Adobe Captivate again. And once you open Adobe Captivate, let's see if it works out or not. Maybe I'll be uploading some things out here, and maybe it says 26 minutes. Forget about it. Alright, so let's wait for it for just a sec. Yeah, it says now in case of loading, let's see what it does. Just gonna wait a sec. Okay, loading. I hope that does work. Okay, that does work. Okay, that merely started off. Well, that was a problem. So, how you can come across this problem is to go onto your font folder that you just merely created. See, it does work. <laughs> I can't believe this. Alright. So go on blank project video demo all the else stuff. We really don't wanna make it the way that we wanted to. Well that we can record videos alright. I'm gonna be recording videos from this later on. So let's simply close it up we kept it for that. I really don't want it to be kept it going off. The thing about Captivate is that is the problem that we're facing out here is that some fonts could not be loaded by Captivate. Instead of that Captivate already uses type kit, Adobe type kit and that simply simply goes off and Adobe Capture could not start with that. So the thing you can do is to come across and check on each collection and find out what the culprit font is. You can check out all the recent font you installed. Only the recent one need not to go through everything and you're deleting it. for example you got to this and you're deleting this font and remember that's gonna take years for you to do so. So I'm gonna go back and copy these fonts. Let's go back to this PC here, Windows, Fonts, right click and we're gonna paste all these inside so that gonna do and yes and that's gonna replace every single font out there so that will be it for today and you need to go on to everyone and check onto the collections and delete let's see all the recent font that you might have installed and that's gonna do the work and it'll be captivate my font as you think it should be so make sure to like and subscribe it's Rosie Dick I'm signing out